Afghanistan goes to the polls on Saturday for presidential elections that are meant to mark the first democratic transfer of power in its history. The country's current president for more than 12 years, Hamid Karzai, is due to stand down as he's constitutionally barred from seeking another term in office. But I'm honest. There are a total of eight candidates for Afghanistan's top job, with a tight race predicted between the three front runners, which include Zalmay Rasul, Afghanistan's former foreign minister. Ashraf Ghani Ahmadze is a former finance minister and World Bank official. He previously contested the 2000 elections but came fourth. Abdullah Abdullah is a doctor and former foreign minister. He was a close associate of Ahmad Shah Massoud, the Northern Alliance leader assassinated in 2001. 13 million people are eligible to vote in Afghanistan's election. Security has been tightened in the cities as the Islamic rebel group, the Taliban, has vowed to derail the elections.